In this video, we're going to do a basic installation for Print Anyway. Let's run the Print Anyway installer. If you do not have IIS 6 or higher installed, we'll need to enable IIS in the control panel. Go to Programs and Features. Select Turn Windows Features On or Off, then check the box for Internet Information Services and choose OK. Now let's choose Close, hit OK, and Finish. Let's rerun the Print Anyway installer. Choose Next, then Next again. Let's choose Complete, and press Install. Please choose Finish and allow the application to run. If during the install it asks you for .NET Framework, please choose Download and install this feature. Let's choose Close. Depending on your environment, you can put in your domain, a username, and password. But for this standalone install, we're going to put in the computer's name as the domain and a local admin account and password. To find the computer's name, we're going to open Settings. We're going to go to System and scroll down the left hand side to About. Then we'll choose About. Find the device name and copy it. Paste the computer name into the domain, then add the local username and password. Then we'll choose Next. Because we don't have SQL installed, we need to go ahead and download SQL Express. I'm going to do a quick search for SQL Express and choose the Microsoft Top Hit site. Choose Download Now. And let's run the downloaded file. Choose Yes to run the downloaded application. Choose Basic Installation, hit Accept, and hit Install. Once SQL Express is installed, choose Close. Confirm we want to exit, yes. Choose Next. Choose Next. Choose Next. Choose Next and Finish. Now let's open Print Anyway. We'll need to put in our serial number. Choose Next. 
type in your company name, or in this case it was automatically added, and choose finish. Let's allow the application to run, and congratulations, Print Anyway is installed.